exactly. It's been a privilege. I mean, I should say this was a fascinating event, so full of energy. It was really a privilege to have all these famous producers, directors, writers, as well as actors and actresses, obviously, here in New York. Now, for those who might not be familiar with Emmys, I should clarify first that this is not the Emmys that many are familiar with, the national ones that, are, that is usually hosted in Los Angeles. This is the International Emmy Awards that is held here in uh, New York every November. Today was the 45th uh, event, the gala uh, dinner, and we've seen uh uh, scores of countries represented today, uh, they were competing in 11 uh, categories. Now, to give you uh, a few of the winners, we know that the best performance for a female went to uh, Anna Friel from Britain, and the best performance uh, by a male actor uh, went to uh, uh, Ma uh, Zanju Marudo from Philippines. Now, just as every year we've had uh, TV productions, particularly from Mexico and Brazil, uh, that that earned some of the uh, awards, but there was an unprecedented development. For the first time, we've seen a TV production from Turkey win the Emmy Awards this year. Uh, the director and the producer. I hope this trend continues and other Turkish series win this award like us in the future. We have so many good productions. I hope they can make it here as well. My shoelaces were untied. I got so excited that I was scared of falling before making it to the stage. We are so happy. Uh, Well, um, you know, we've seen this uh, momentum building really since 2006. There has been uh, quite a few uh, telenovelas and TV drama productions from Turkey. Uh, we're seeing them being exported to the Middle East and Latin America. Some of them are very famous. People are actually asking us about some of the other uh, TV series as well. But for the first time this year, we are seeing uh, an Emmy Award going to a Turkish TV further momentum for progress in the Turkish TV industry.